Hi, in this video I'll show you how you can color smoke using GIMP and this works best if the smoke is on a black background and this one here may appear to be black but it's not completely black so I'm going to change that by using the select by color tool and change the threshold here to just one and then I'm going to click and select the color that I want Next I want to fill this selection with black color and our foreground color right now is black so I can use the keyboard shortcut control comma or go to the edit fill with foreground color and this will fill this selection with black color. Next I'll go to select none. After that I need to create a new layer using this option and just use the defaults layer field type transparency and then just click OK. Then I want to change the layer mode to overlay. Next I'm going to select the blend tool and also choose the gradient from here. And let's say I'm going to use this one. Then I'm going to click around here, drag like this and then release my mouse. And you see how this changed the color of the smoke but also affected the cigarette here so I'm going to grab the eraser tool, choose a brush and also adjust the size of the brush and then I'm going to paint over the cigarette here and I'm actually going to leave some of the effect on the tip and this is how you can cover smoke using a gradient and of course you can use any of the gradients that come with GIMP or you can create your own gradients. I have made detailed tutorials about that in the beginner's guide videos. You can also do this using the brush tool. First I'm going to press the delete key and this will remove all the color information from the layer and leave only the transparency. Then I'm going to click over here on the foreground color. This will start the color selection dialog and I can choose a color let's say this orange color and I can start painting over to color the smoke and of course I can select another color and continue so this is how easy it is to color smoke using GIMP and I hope this tutorial was useful if it was subscribe like the video leave a comment that's it for now bye